dansant. Écoutez et répétez. Well, I love cubism. It's my favorite style. When I see a cubist painting, I just gotta smile. But there's one painter I'm his biggest fan. He's the father of cubism. His name's Cezanne, Cezanne. Cezanne, Cezanne, the father of cubism. Well, some people say that it was Picasso. Other people claim it was the Kiriko. Some people think it was Montigliere. But they're all crazy. It was Paul Cezanne, Cezanne. When Paul Cezanne sat down to paint a flower on his face, he had to solve one problem, three-dimensional space. He said, form his content, it's more the gitan. He was right. Now he's Paul Cezanne. Cezanne, 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 the painter of cubism. Cezanne, 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 the guitar. Father wanted him to be an avocado. The Paul just looked at him and he went, Man, oh, pa. I want to be a painter. I know I can. Now it's Hoover's in the Louvre. He's Paul Cezanne, Cezanne. Cezanne, Cezanne, the father of Cubism. Well, I had an aunt and she was in a coma. So I loaded up her bed and we took her up to MoMA. We got through the door. You wouldn't believe what began. She sat up and started screaming, hey, where is that Paul Cezanne? Cezanne, Cezanne, the reckless father of Cubism. Well, Paul Cezanne is famous now, and I think that's pretty nice. His melons look like footballs, and his apples look like dice. So all you would be painters, get out your brush and can. You may be the next Paul Cezanne, 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 the father of Cubism. Father of Cubism